Alam mo yung mga OFW na katulad ko na nananirahan sa ibang bansa or nagtatrabaho sa ibang bansa, kalimitan eh, naminis natin yung mga pagkain Pilipino, kahit simple lang. So, galing ako sa Pinas, ano, nagdala ko ng maraming pulburon. So, favorite ng anak ko yun, eh ngayon wala na, naubos na yun. So, they are asking for more actually, but... Wala akong pulburo na maibigay sa kanila. But I have materials here. I have I am complete with materials sa aking kitchen. So, I decided today I will make pulburon. And it's very easy. All you need to do is patience sa pagluluto. So, let's go! So, these are the materials that we need or the ingredients that we need in making pulburon. Sugar. Flour, that is the main ingredients. The milk, the butter. If you don't have butter, you can use margarine. And we need frying pan and saver or panghalo and also strain strainer later. Okay, we're going to start by putting flour on the pan. And we're going to mix and mix. Just be patient in mixing. Just lower the flame so that the flour will not burn. So, ayan guys, halo lang ng halo, halo lang ng halo. As you can see, nagiging brown na siya. The flour is not even. Sometimes may maliliit na white na bilog. So, tinatry kong maging even siya. I decided to strain the flour kasi may mga namumuo siyang white. Ganito talaga ang pagluluto. Kailangan may labor of love. Masarap ito pagkatapos. Next, we're going to put the butter. My daughter wants to try it. So, she tried to mix it. But be careful not to burn yourself. After we finish the butter, we put in the milk and the sugar. So guys, this is our fulburon. Yeah, it's kind of messy though, but it's delicious. Yeah, this is the final outcome. 
I don't have pulveron molder in the house, but you can mold it if you have. But for me, we can eat it like this. It's good to eat while you're watching TV it and it, you're only in the house. So guys, what can you say about my very simple pulveron? Please leave a comment, like, share, and consider subscribing. Anyong iga sayo. Bye-bye. God bless.